I am so sorry. <laughs> I haven't made a video in like, well, I haven't posted a video in like three or four weeks. And I'm sorry, it took forever, but I'm finally getting to editing my video to New York. Uh, I don't know how many videos are gonna come out of this. I hope three at least, because it's three different days. But the last night kind of, I was just so tired. But I am so excited. And this video is just about my first solo trip and all about what I did when I got to New York, how it went. And I'm just so excited to finally show you guys what I did while I was there. Um, I've been sitting on the content for like, maybe like two weeks, <laughs> but I just haven't had time to edit. So let's get on with the video and yeah. Okay, so we started our morning very, very early and we headed downtown towards the airport. And honestly, at that time that we left, there wasn't even that much traffic. It wasn't bad getting there. However, I was not expecting to go through such a long line through TSA. I did not record through TSA. However, I was there for a hot minute and I really thought I was gonna miss my flight. Okay, so I am in the airport and there was a lot of people through TSA, but now I'm headed to my um, flight. The only thing is that it, it's super busy and it's really hot and I only took a bunch of clothes because it's supposed to be so cold, so. Okay, so now I am in the airport. I'm still out of breath. But the sunrise, well, I think the, I think the glass is tinted, so, but it looks nice. And I can see my gate from here, and I think they're already boarding, so. So I just arrived, and I left the airplane. Now I'm here. But it's cold, like, oh. I don't think you can see that. At this point, for all I knew, I could have just been going into the middle of nowhere, but luckily it took me to the right place that I needed to go to, plus I had all day. Finally found my way through the train. I messed up and I went in the wrong section, but I made it to Grand Central Station. I've always dreamed about the station because on the very first episode of Gossip Girl, they show Serena Vander Winston and I'm wanting to come here. It's really big. It smells gross. But it's super nice. Oh, I really wanted to take some pictures, but obviously I'm by myself. So there was these really sweet girls and I asked them if they could take pictures. And they said yes. Now 
now I am headed to this is cathedral that's really cool so I want to go there and see what it's like so I just left the Grand Central Terminal and now I am off to a cathedral that is over here I'm excited about that and I haven't eaten anything all morning so I probably should do that but I'm not really hungry so never mind so I said earlier I wanted to go to the, the library and I found it by accident too because I was going to go somewhere else I'm in the library and I had a slight fit change. It's really hot, but it's really pretty. I made it inside the library. It's gorgeous. gorgeous place inside um they do have sections to like read and stuff like that but it's more for like the sections that are quiet are really quiet but it's gorgeous it's so pretty inside. it was super late at this point so i was excited for lunch time okay that last clip i filmed it incredibly I'm sitting by myself, but the restaurant's really cute and super chic. I haven't eaten anything all day, so hopefully, oh man, for a while at least. which is literally ham and butter in French and with a baguette and then I got an iced tea because although it's cold outside I'm sweating so I wanted something to refresh myself and I've been drinking a lot more water lately so I'm trying to stay hydrated today but I don't want to buy anything because my arm is killing me from carrying that bag although it looks small there's like almost 20 pounds in there so my shoulder is hurting so I wanted to choose places to sit down where I could just relax and I didn't have to be out and about walking hopefully time will go by faster so that by the time it's 4 o'clock I can go and be like right out the door so that I can do check -in. I am at the Frog So this is where we normally keep the Christmas tree, but obviously it's not Christmas anymore. So I'm cold, my hands are really red, and I don't have gloves. So and oh, I'm gonna get um, I'll go around to show you guys. I made it into Central Park and I'm right at the edge because you can see the buildings behind me. And I'm just so excited. I'm gonna walk around carrying my bag. And then hopefully by the time I'm done, it's 4 o'clock. Okay, so I'm in the park that I am in Woman Rank 
and oh, and there are things like the liquid over the ice so that it can get harder. <laughs> Okay, so I am inside of the tap. I can't remember the name. So I'm going to take a seat. But that is the iconic scene where um, Blair and Chuck got married. I really don't want him to come here because of that. So I have been walking in the park for about 45 minutes, close to an hour. <laughs> I'm halfway there I'm gonna keep walking but if I can't make it I'm just gonna buy the subway because it's too far of a walk honestly I think I could but I'm not used to wearing like shoes that have a little bit of a heel on it so so I had finally made it to the Airbnb and I did make my whole way walking there. However at this point I had sat around for about an hour and I was just getting ready to watch the phantom of the opera and this was almost a final look i did um put on a bigger coat because it was super cold but yeah so now i'm going to go see the musical i'm like an hour early an hour and a half early so i'm going to stop for some food but look it does well, I don't know if you can see them. It says Hotel Empire, just like in Gossip Girl. Not like one scene. But, um... Little yeah. did I know that I was super far away and I had to walk and I barely made it in time to see the musical. I made it! I made it! I am here to watch... Oh, you can't see it. I'm here to watch The Phantom. And I'm so excited. We're all going to Phantom. But, um, but yeah. So after watching the musical, I did buy some merch and once again, I am never disappointed by the musical. It is my favorite, so that was the whole point of the trip. I am just out of the musical and I am walking towards Times Square. I'm so excited. It was so good. Not my first time watching it on Broadway. I cried a couple times because the musical is so symbolic to me and so iconic. I I love it. So it was getting kind of late and I did grab a quick slice of pizza because I was a little scared because it was my first time traveling by myself. I am in Times Square. It is so iconic. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, share, like, and I will see you in the next one.